joining us now in studio today, we have Ryan Klazowski and Jamie Wright. Ryan, be honest with me. How did I do? Give me a grade on the you, last I, name. Honestly, <laughs> like, very well. Yeah. I was nervous. I don't get nervous often. So you got I'm the like, last close, name right, but close, I can't say Detroit City Distillery. There we go. It's Maybe okay. the buzz <laughs> It'll get you. It'll trip you up. Good. Well, thanks for being on with us this afternoon. How excited are you for this NFL draft and everything that comes with yeah. it? Because we've had anticipation for a while. No, absolutely. I think it, this is a unique circumstance because it's like the kind of one of the first times that Detroit gets like a real tourist like so people are seeing the city for the first time people that are like around uh, cities in the Midwest are coming to our city for the first time so we're super excited to welcome them and then kind of offer something special for that and what kind of events are you guys going to be happening for the draft coming so we actually normally have tours on Thursday evenings and Saturdays but for the next week we've actually opened up tours for Tuesday Wednesday Thursday and Friday during the day and then still our Saturday tours um, we also, next Friday, we have our cocktail lounge. Um, this was something that we started doing during, actually during COVID, um, for people to come in and, you know, see the space, but spaced apart. And it had a huge cult following. We did it um, two months ago, yep. a month ago, and it sold out immediately. So we're like, wow. we got to bring this back when we have all these people coming in from out of town. So we're doing that Friday night at 5, 7, and 9, but 7 o'clock has already sold out. Wow. So you get all those tickets online for all the tours and um, the cocktail lounge. I got to sign up quick. Yeah, yes. yeah, I do. Yes. You at home, you probably noticed our news desk here has been taken over a bit. <laughs> You're concocting something, yes, right? Yes. So uh, I love when drinks are blue. That's always a great yeah. sign. <laughs> so first off, and probably the most important one is the Blue Roar. That's going to be our limited edition draft cocktail. Oh, Again, I said we wanted tired. to do something. I mean, you said it, not me. I, I don't know if we can technically say it, but yes. Uh, <laughs> I think we wanted to do something to celebrate just this event coming to the city. So we wanted to pay an homage to a local sports team. And so we have actually a frozen version. Uh, it comes in liquid form, but we froze it in ice cube trays just to bring something a little special to the news desk today. Do not Fun. freeze it in the bottle, Yes, guys. do not it delicious freeze it in the in bottle. This, in this form, but not in the glass bottle. Don't put that in your freezer. And so, you can buy it in two sizes, right? Because I'm seeing two different sizes of okay, the, no. the well, that desk. Is, that's just one of our yeah, secondaries that is some, uh, for the other cocktail that we're yeah, making. But so, I mean, we really like that sticker, so we've just been putting it on everything. Yeah, so Why not? Here frozen, is the right? frozen edition in the okay. DC So glass. this is the frozen blue. Roar. Yeah, that was a little more delicious. graffiti marketing. So, and what you I'll give you the umbrella. umbrella. Yeah, so the Blue Roar is a uh, blue raspberry. It has lemon, <laughs> peach, oh. a little bit of bergamot, and a, a decent amount of pineapple. I keep telling people think tropical mm. lemonade. And I will that say, I know as of coming on to like the set today, we had 50 remaining for pre-order. So after that, wow. you will only be able to get it in person next week during the draft. So. I love this because it tastes so tropical. Sweet. Like you mentioned, I'm it's a very sweet, sweet fan. Mm -hmm. yes. Okay, you said you have another one? I do. I have oh another goodness. one. So okay. this is going to just be a Blue Hawaiian. We wanted to offer up the viewers something like, we make the Blue Roar. You can come down and get that with us. But if they want a blue cocktail for the draft and they just want to make it at home, we at DCD like support that. So get creative. All right. So you're giving us the full recipe. You're yes, not gatekeeping yes. as so, they say. No, God no absolutely not. So no. this one is a, uh, it's going to be blue curacao, summer rum. Love blue God. curacao. It's just and fun then, looking, right? Like, whenever I go to a bar, yes. I, I know like next to nothing about any like mixed drink or anything. I'm like the blue blue curacao, like mm. some people call it like a the mother blue pucker. Caraco, you yes. know, yeah. You just want to taste it. Sweet and that. If it's me, you'll take it. All right. Yeah. So yeah, it's our, our lost summer rum, um, our blue or blue curacao, a uh, pineapple, and then we also have lemon and a little bit of Coco Lopez in this uh, not so enticing Wait, what container. What is Coco over. Lopez? Uh, it's creme de coconut. So oh. yeah, it gives you a very tropical vibe. I'm so that, this is gonna be another tropical drink. Yeah. 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 We kind of want, like I said, we wanted to give people in case they wanted to make it at home and they we either sold out of the Blue Roar or they just wanted to make something while watching it at home. Mm -hmm. Give cool. people options. So. Yeah, realistically, not out. everybody's gonna be downtown. They're gonna be entertaining, exactly. playing hostess, and this is what a way to impress your guests. Yes, yeah. so and this is just a really yeah, it's oh, a really fun looking cocktail. Goodness. I love how the color is too. Like both are just so electric blue. There you are. So. Did you intentionally match your nails? You know, I did it, but then somebody <laughs> actually asked me about the other day, and I was like, yeah, I'm going to roll with we that. We need a tight shot on Jamie's right? nails. Exactly. I mean, these, these <laughs> I are the Aurora <laughs> colors right here. Doing the most. Okay, I'll so how one. can people find you, learn more about your upcoming events? You said the 7 p.m. slots already uh, Already sold, sold out. out. Yep, you can sign up for 5 and 9. Um, go to our website, DetroitCityDistillery.com. And that's where you're going to have all of our information, including you can sign up for our newsletter. So then whenever we do have some really fun activations coming out, you would be the first person to find out. You can sign up for our whiskey club. 
Um, yep. I'm actually personally going to be at the Foundation Hotel next week, um, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. And they're going to be doing a special satellite bar right in their elevator lobby. Mm -hmm. So wow. I'll be there with their head bartender, Peter, serving up more DCD cocktails for the draft. Um, yeah, and so also a pro tip, I know we mentioned the cocktail lounge earlier. Yeah. Um, this will likely, after we go off the air, sell out uh, oh, today yes. for pre-order. Today. So wow. okay. I would I say mean, it's um, delicious. It's if you want to secure a bottle, the cocktail lounge actually comes with a bottle of Blue Roar. So if you're looking for oh. something to do at 9 o'clock on Friday, you'll get a seat at the cocktail lounge as well as a bottle of this. So it's another way to kind of secure a bottle rather than hoping you get a couple of the hundred that are floating around during the draft. Yeah, so if you go online, they're only $10 for the bottle. But yeah, they come with the ticket for the cocktail lounge. Yep, I Wonderful. Totally All right, I need you guys to share your confidence in the Lions this season. How oh, are they going to do? It's oh, astronomical. I can't like, wait. It's, yes. it's beyond yes. the frame yeah. right We now, just so. need to put it out there for We've you. We've been Good riding the bandwagon at Detroit City Distillery for a long time. Yeah. And this, this year is our year. Yeah, so, sure. and plus they released the New Jerseys today. And they looked wonderful so they oh you saw that you know that dress leak? good yeah i, I mean say, technically, leak, so. leak? Yeah, Ryan, i don't know what you're talking hey the about. lions acknowledge it yeah. alan mcneil like acknowledge it so it's all good all right ryan and jamie well, thank, thank you both thank so you much guys. we appreciate it thank you cheers delicious. one more time oh, she's going back to the frozen I one i like this frozen it's one so it's good, good. it's very good